Hello, in this video I will show you how I get into my protein suit. Here we have all the pieces, 13 pieces in total. First I connect the feet to the leg armor and they are connected together with belt buckles and velcro. And uh, as you can see, they're up close. And the crutch area is connected the same way with a lot of buckles. Like really, <laughs> a lot to make sure it stayed in place. And I connected the wire from one leg to the other leg. And one of the legs has the power bank and little controller that controls the lights. And here we have the uh, upper body, the fair part of it. And here I connect the shoulder pieces to the fair parts. And it's also connected with buckles. And there's uh, two holes in the fur. So you can stick the buckles through there. And also so you can stick the wire through. And then I just slip my arm through there. And on one of them I have a long wire that goes down to the leg area. And also the two shoulder pieces get connected there too. They are two separate pieces. And yeah, I just slip the long, longest wire down through the fair part and through the leg. And gets connected somewhere down there. And last I connect the power bank. And it lights up. And time to <laughs> slip in the whole thing. It's pretty much like put on another fursuit, bodysuit, except that this took a lot of work because the armor was very stiff and I had to sit down and kind of move back and forth to <laughs> kind of get the get my feet down into the fursuit feet. That's, it, it was a lot of work and standing up was not that easy to do. <laughs> Yeah, even after I stood up, I had to wait. <laughs> like really struggle to get the whole thing up. And then slip the uh, tail through the tail hole and close the belts. Slip the arms on, just like on a normal bodysuit. And I had this zipper on my back, so I couldn't close it myself. I sadly need help for that. Then I slipped the uh, upper body armor on just over my head. Sadly I can't close the side either by myself because I can't really reach that well. So I would need help for that too. Uh, I tried to fix it with some velcro. And then I just slipped the head on. And 
And then the hand pulse, just like normal hand pulse. And then last the visor on the head. And there you have it, that's how I suit up with my protein fursuit. It, it takes a while and a lot of work to get into it. And yeah, I can't really walk that well in it, if you can ask. So thank you so much for watching and I have videos on how I made this whole thing. So feel free to check that out.